Hey guys, it's Tom Box beginning the vlog here. Going down to PAX West. Yeah, oh yeah, there's do not enter there. It's a one way. It is, okay, we're just driving through a one way. Okay, great way to start the trip, guys. No, you can't turn left. You can't turn left. There's an island. Yeah, okay, well, there we go. Starting off strong. We have, we have Care Box. We have, we have Natalie, my coworker. We have MST TV Trist on the wheel. And Trist Mini, Trevor. We've arrived, day one, Friday, and uh, I'm just really tired. We're actually here now at the convention center. Uh, one of the most awkward washroom situations. Going up, going out? No, going up is not going out. Um, yes, I don't know what's going on. Like right now it's super early, it's like 6.40 something. Uh, I think there's a line building up already, so. Line has begun. It's not that bad. It's cosplayers, we're not. It's okay. I'm literally gonna do my makeup in this line. Okay, sounds I've good. Decided. Sounds good. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. <laughs> Don't look at me. Don't look at me. <laughs> All right, just mini. <laughs> What's up? What's up? What's your name? I'm Evan. How are you doing? Is this a vlog? Ian. Hey. Hey, yeah, this is a vlog. This is a vlog. Of course it's a vlog. YouTuber. Well, of course I'm a YouTuber. Anyways, <laughs> so I heard that there's Neo Pack Silver Skins. Right? There's Neo Pack Silver Skins? Yeah. 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 Okay, so that's something I'm going to pick out, out of the grab bag. Just, just like many just, just loot it out of the bag. <laughs> Ignore the rest of them. <laughs> people get their grab bag. They get nothing. <laughs> We're terrible people. Hey, it's been 25 minutes since I've <laughs> vlogged anything. It's still 25 minutes. We got about two and a half hours to go. <laughs> I'm Ashburn. This is Tom Bucks at Twitch booth. Yeah, I think it's Twitch booth. I think we're here to earn a pin. I don't know if it's worth it. Is it worth it? Earn a pin. No. 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 Chill out over there. For the Monster Hunter. Yeah, I feel like over there, that's been more epic over there. Damn, I'm showing a shadow verse, but like behind this is uh is Monster Hunter. Shadow verse. Well met, I mean uh whatever they say. <laughs> what pin did you just get? Arcade pin? That's pretty nice. I got destroyed by her. I was winning, she was at one life and boom, 13, 10, I'm dead. Death wing, I mean, uh, Mysterious Dragon. Mysterious Dragon. Bahamut. Bahamut, yeah, Bahamut. that's right. So, we're at Dauntless now. I don't even know what this game is about. It's like Monster Hunter. It's like Monster Hunter? Hey, you beat Tom. I opened it already. It's just a card. Yeah. yeah. It's a, it's a promo card apparently. I opened mine, what do you think? Now we attack Beauty and the Beast. I got Beauty and the Beast too. Oh, they're all Beauty and the Beast. No. Pack opening, guys. Pack opening. <laughs> oh, hey, they have a little indentation for this yeah, one. What do you have? They said easy to open. Oh, yeah. Now, if I can't open it, I'm a scrub. Oh, it's a foil wanna... card, man. I don't even know what's good and what's bad. Heck yeah, it's super good. It looks. Oh, it looks ultra cut. Wow, it's oh. a jobber walk. Jobber walk. Whoa! I got an A cost. What oh, Alice? Ready? This card's actually pretty nice. Oh, right, oh that. Yeah, that Bahamut card looks so right. Alice, you got, you got the cover card. What do you got? What do you got? Oh my god. I got like such the... horrible. Oh my god. Oh, god. I played the oh, Shadow Walkie. You brought me to one health. You got a Jabba Walkie. That's impressive. Nice one, guys. So we got two Jabba Walks. Okay, we got two of this Alice, two Jabba Walks, and two Beauty and the Beast. Hold on, I didn't open it. Opening, guys. Pack open. Pack open. Cinderella, Cinderella. Oh, you got Cinderella, too. Okay. Wait, oh. No. What's that? Oh. The Wizardess of Oz. Wizardess of Oz. Oh, I'll get that Bahamut. Jabber Walk. Oh, yeah. Jabber Walk. It's over. It's over. The cards do look very nice. The cards back? Holy crap. Yeah. We were fighting over the Cinderella. I mean, no, it's there going to be a physical Imagine card. having to have a full deck of these yeah, cards. Yeah, these cards are really nice. nice. Well, I feel kind of baller. <laughs> Red Mage. 
Huh? Now you can cast both yeah. both spells. White and black all magic. Good. All the spells. Expert in nothing. I don't even know this guy. I'm just spying on him. Is he a scrub? I don't know, but it's only on the internet regardless. He throws it. Oh, oh, he got. Oh. Hey guys, it's Tombox. I kind of bailed out on my group because I decided to go play some Factorio tournament. I actually don't know how you actually compete. If you guys have been paying attention on my Discord, I've been playing a lot of Factorio. It's quite addictive. And uh, just so happens, there's a tournament, so I'm going to try it out. Yeah, so I failed at the uh, Factorio tournament and uh, got some Discord swag and just Final Fantasy stuff. They have a booth selling stuff, so that's actually pretty nice this year. Usually they don't have that. Final Fantasy sleeves, man. I just stepped on something. I have no idea what I stepped on. You stepped on a straw. Okay, well, it's just a straw. Time to uh, actually get back to the hotel and drop off some stuff. It's mine. mine. Next up, FF14 boss battle, I think. Why, what a pretty shirt you have there. Right now we're snuck into the FF14 line to beat Susano. That's right, they have there is a boss fight. Once again. We're noobs. We need we need someone to carry us. Yes, please carry. Please. If this was Yu-Gi-Oh, I'd just kaiju that Susano. Alright, we just got, we just won the shirt thanks to our party leader. Our party leader right here, Brandon. Or also known as uh, Surat Aralak on Balmung. Yes, <laughs> thanks to him, we got we beat Susano. And there's our party. This is the rest of our party. Thanks we get a whole party a out of here. Experience party. Yeah. Not a single wipe. No wipe. I kept dying though. I was I was the I was the uh, weakest link. <laughs> you were new to the game. You did fine. All right. If it makes you feel any better, I was the tank. I've done this before and I died too. So it happens. All right. Thank you so much, guys. Hello, Tom Box. Hey. What are we eating today? I'm having a crepe right now, and then we're probably gonna have all you can eat hot pot. Yeah. And where can't we go today? Cause it's so busy. Can't go to Cheesecake Factory. Holy crap! Impossible. Yeah. Look at that crowd. It's like a concert. Right. The ratatouille is real. Okay. We just got to the hotel. And uh, since I don't have a camera, man, you guys can see what's going on here. This is the washroom. It is spectacular. I think it looks more grand than the room. There's a tub. There's a toilet. And everything's made of uh, stone. Granite. Pretty epic stuff. And the camera is out of battery. Well, I guess I'll charge up before I start filming again. Hey guys, it's day two now, this is Saturday, and uh, I just took a shower because I don't want to smell like a convention nerd. Or maybe I should not shower and give them the full experience. No, I'm not going to be filthy. I took a shower, it's really nice. And uh, not too much to go on today. I did just to try games last we left off. The battery died, and we ate a lot of hot pot. And oh my god, I got to show you something. If I can catch the first floor washroom, I will show you guys what was wrong with that first floor washroom. There's a whole story about it, which I'll share with you guys later. It is 8 in the morning, and the lineup for Nintendo's panel has already begun. The first set of the crowd is up there. I'm in the second set. There's a third set, and that's about it. So, and the panel stops at 10. That's how early I have to actually have to line up for these things. Or else there's a chance of not even coming in. So it's only been an hour and the lineup really filled up. Like crazy, crazy stuff. We're in the Nintendo panel. What are you doing? I can't even see what's going on because the screen's so bright. No, they can't. 
So this is what we got from the door. This is some collector's posters. Three, one of three. Well, we actually got all three. Change it. Mission of Zelda, and of course the most anticipated one, the never before seen Star Fox 2, which is also an ad for the Nintendo Classic Edition that I mentioned before. So the Nintendo event just ended, and let's just say, if you're a swag hunter, don't go to Nintendo. Yeah, you're not going to get anything out of it. And the game that they were demoing was um, Metroid uh, Return of Samus. Although the gameplay is very nice and all, but the game's coming out in like two weeks, so there's nothing really new about it. So if you don't go to it, you don't really miss out on anything at all. Yeah, you get some posters. So it's kind of disappointing. Wish I went to Gearbox. Gearbox always give away free games. If you're a swag hunter, go to Gearbox. If you're, that's your future packs. If you guys haven't seen this place before, this is the main hall where they have the biggest theater. That's the entrance side. That's where you line up if you want to line up early. Yeah, over there. Many noobs have made mistakes of going straight to the hall, not knowing that this is the actual lineup. You guys, it's Hombox here, and I just got the grab bag from PAX. I didn't get it on Friday because uh, I was too tired. But uh, this year they gave out this Neo Silver skin for League players. I think there's one in every grab bag, so if you haven't got yours, you can grab it. Uh, aside from that, there is an RNG chance in these bags now. And the RNG that you can go for is if you're into squishies and stressed balls, I believe there is a there is a doll in here. Let me grab it. So my bag, I'm just holding the camera very awkwardly. My bag, I got the blue minion. Apparently, there is also a red minion. And luckily for me, uh, a nice guy called Jimmy, one of one of my friends' friend, decided to give me the red minion too. Oh, that's so sick, so sick. Anyways, more stuff coming up soon. You opened it, it's not mint anymore. Oh, by the way, we are actually right now at a steak and shake. Let's give him some free advertisement. <laughs> Minion. It's all mine. No, actually, we're gonna review. This is actually gonna be the first food segment of this whole thing. Wow. I can't believe we actually didn't eat all day yesterday. So don't do that. We'll get sick. Yeah, don't remind me. And she'll get hangry and we just don't want to deal with a lady's hangry. That's right. Okay, so I just got the regular stuff, the most basic meal available on their menu. And firstly, the fries, they're a little thinner than McDonald's fries. A little thinner. But it's got a good crunch, very similar to McDonald's fries. A little bit better. Not salty though. The shake, on the other hand, steak and shake, is very thick. Luckily, they already knew that, so they kind of gave me a spoon. Yes, eating American fast food. Okay, as for my final review, the pickle I really like. They use like but in like thin small slices of pickle, they use like the diagonal cut, which is I think much better. I unless of course you don't like pickles. The meat's nice and juicy. I just don't like the construction of it because they put the ketchup at the bottom and after a while it kind of sogs into the bun, so that's kind of like eh, I could work on it. But overall, it's not too bad. The cheese is very cheesy. I don't know why I'm saying cheese is cheesy, but like, it's got more cheese flavor than typical cheese that you melt on a burger, which is a bit unique. Aside from that, other than that, it's pretty standard. It's pretty good. I'll have it again. shoe imaginable. It's a sponge. This is a warning for all the guys out there when your girlfriend's shopping. Oh my God, <laughs> We've been here like 10 minutes. I'm not even talking about the duration when she asked you a question. It has, to, it has to be good. If it's not good, it means she has bad taste. If it's good and she doesn't believe you, you're screwed either way. It's a trap. Void at all costs. <laughs> oh, I'm actually not looking for anything. It's her care box who's looking for something because there's parties, of course, at PAX, the after parties, and there's lots of drinking. Pretty normal. Oh no, she's asking a question again. 
It's okay. 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 Yeah, it's okay. It's it's decent. It looks really hot though. Decent. I've decent. activated a trap card. I'm gonna get out of here. I found something that's that's your color. It's your favorite color. It's purple. Right here. Nice and thick. Maroon. That okay. is maroon. This is purple. Okay, fine. This marine thing. You're going for the hot look, right? So you'll be nice and hot in this dress. Mm -hmm. Very hot. Boiling hot is a new look. Oh yeah, sweltering heat. <laughs> you can sweat all over the dance floor. <laughs> I'm an alien wear trying to win some raffle tickets, giveaways, things I always do. Let's hope I can win some good karma. Oh, hashtag karma. Man. <laughs> I really want to try that VR, but right now I'm in line for this. Wolfenstein to kill Nazis. Get milkshakes. Nazis are worth milkshakes now. Get your get your Nazis worth of milkshake. American <laughs> size. American size. Yeah, that's really good. Yeah. Yeah, it's okay. so right around the corner right here at the diner. Wait, this way? Yeah, there's the milkshake. It's Tom Brooks again. Uh, no, we didn't win anything at Alienware. Seems like giveaway doesn't give giveaway karma. Not yet. I have fallen. on. Looks yummy. Why do you have to say it with such a weird accent? <laughs> what is wrong with my accent too? <laughs> I think I burned the roof of my mouth doing that. <laughs> That's what he gets for playing Firewall FTK. Hey! <laughs> How many kicks should I get? I really never get anything fancy. But I always seem to get the mango key lime cheesecake every time. The whole brick. <laughs> the whole brick. <laughs> we were too full to eat the cheesecake, so we'll eat it later. Looks good. But okay, let's tally up the loot. Loot wise, what do we got? Silver skins, I'll probably give these out on my Facebook somewhere. We got some Shadowverse cards. These are very collectibles. Apparently, some of these are selling for a lot. Dark Alice, I think, is about 40 bucks online. There are minions, a Hands of God t shirt, and band. And if you play Hands of God or Smite, you get skins. Or if you even play Paladin, there's a skin in here too. So that's kind of cool. And the cup noodle is actually part of the swag. It's a super fight card. There's some collectible Nintendo poster and the cup noodle sticker. Oh, the cup noodle sticker. And that would be the end of day two. I am actually super tired. I actually tried to look for some Yu-Gi-Oh today apparently and uh, there's none. So I guess I will not be FTKing anyone this packs. Usually I win one mat per packs. And last year there was none. Talked to the guy that currently works for Konami now, and he explained why there was none last year, and well now he doesn't work for, uh, I guess, those game companies anymore, so I guess there's none for PAX this year. Well, I guess don't expect Yu-Gi-Oh! at PAX, at least not at PAX West anyway. I guess we'll move on to day three after this.